Hello, how to evaluate with a calculator? This is 8 power 7 minus 8 power 6. I can express this 7 here as summation of 6 and 1. So I have 8 power 6 plus 1 minus 8 power 6. If you have a power n plus n, this equals a power n times a power n. I apply this right here. F a power six times a power one minus a power six. So the next thing we are going to do will be to factor out a power six. F a power six times. This divides a power six. I have eight minus a power six divided a power six. I have one. So from here. Of 8 power 6 times 8 minus 1. This is 7. So, what we are going to do will be to express this 8 here in terms of 2. Of 8 equals 2 times 2 times 2. And this is 2 power 3. So, this will be 2 to the power of 3. 3 to the power of 6 times 7. And if you have a power x to the power of y equals a power x times y. So we have 3 times 6, that is 18. I have 2 power 18 times 7. So we need to find the value of 2 power 18. I can simply have this as 2 to the power of 10 plus 8. That is 18. We have times 7. And if you have a power x plus y equals a power x times a power y, I will simply have 2 power 10 times 2 power 8 times 7. So we need to find the value of 2 power 10. This is 2 power 5 times 2, that is 2 power 10, times 2 power 8, times 7. And from here, I have 2 power 5 to the power of 2 times 2 power 8, times 7. So from here, 2 power 5, that is 32, that is 2 into 5 places, power 2, times 2 power 8, that is 256 times 7. So we have 32 power 2, that's 32 times 32, that's 1024 times 256 times 7. So right now, we are going to multiply this. We have 1024 times 256. We multiply, we start with 6, 6 times 4, 24, 4 carry over 2, 6 times 2, 12 plus 2, 14, 4 carry over 1, 6 times 0, 0 plus 1, 6 times 1, we have 6, 5 times 4, 20, 0 carry over 2, 5 times 2, 10 plus 2, 12, 2 carry over 1. 5 times 0, 0, 0 plus 1, we have 1. 5 times 1, we have 5. Then we consider 2. 2 times 4, 8. 2 times 2, 4. 2 times 0, 0, 2 times 1. We add up everything together. This is 4, 4. This is 11, 1 carry over 1 up here. This is 7 plus 1, 8, 8 plus 4, 12 to carry over 1 up here. 6, we have 2. So we have 2, 6, 2, 1, 4, 4. We multiply this by 7 to have our final answer. So to do that, you simply have 
7 times 4, that is 28, 8 carry over 2. 7 times 4 again, 28 plus 2, 30, 0 carry over 3. 7 times 1, 7 plus 3, 10, 0 carry over 1. 7 times 2, 14, 14 plus 1, 15, 5 carry over 1. 7 times 6, that will be at least 7 times 5 is 35. Or 7 times 5 is 30. So 7 times 6 will be 42, right? So we have 42. 42 plus 1. That is 43. So we have 3 and carry over 4. So we have 7 times 2. That is 14 plus 4. That is 18. So right now, our answer for 8, this is 8 power 7 minus 8 power 6 equals 1 million, 835,008. And don't forget the fact that 8 is 2 power 3, we have 2 power 3 power 7 minus 2 power 3 power 6 equals 1,835,008. So if you multiply these exponents, you have 2 power 21 minus 2 power 18 equals 1,835,008. So ladies and gentlemen, here is it. Now we have gotten our answer without the use of calculator. So don't forget to subscribe and share this video. Thank you and goodbye.